This video demonstrates using dashboards with sales channels to provide for different structures depending on how a product was sold. For this example, we'll go into the music industry where they often have a different structure based on if the product was sold versus streamed. So in the setup orders, we'll see that Dashbook has created physical, digital, and stream sales channels. You can change these names and add your own, add licensing, whichever you wish. And we're going to go into royalty arrangements and create one. Here is very standard in Dashbook. On the left side is your selection list. You hit the green plus to create one. For royalty arrangement, we're going to unclick the specify single royalty holder and product so that we can have a generic royalty that can be reused. We're call, let's call this first one 100% uh, mechanical. Uh, note that this is just a phrase and it's not going to be used in calculation. To set up the calculation, we're going to say the amount is going to be based on mechanical and we're going to be paying 100% of that. You can pay anything else, obviously. Apply changes and we're done. And we can create a second one, and yes, I'm going a bit fast, and um, make that 50% of net. You can always download our trial and do this in your own speed. So here's net, and make it 50%. Apply changes. Now we have two different generic royalty arrangements that we can reuse. I'll close this screen and go to products then. On products, same. We're going to create a product. You can type in or paste in an ISRC. Uh, let's just call this Song 1. I have to hit the Add as Title, which will automatically fill in a title. You can have multiple products connected to the same title for payment purposes. We're not going to get into that here. Uh, show royalty holders. We need to add as a contributor the different royalty holders and then also connect them in the royalty. So let's go into Contributors. We're not going to change the company name. That can be useful for other things, like your letterhead on your reports. We're going to add a songwriter, called Songwriter 1, and add an artist, incredibly called Artist 1. Now, we have these two royalty holders we can use. We're going to add artist and songwriter as a contributor. When we go to royalties, we can't do anything right now. Um, let's go ahead and apply changes first. We've got these, but it's what it's telling us to do. So we'll go to here, and the artist is going to be paid 50% no matter what happens. It's going to be either 50% of uh, the sale, or um, whether or 50% of what was received for our streams. We don't care. We're just giving them 50% every time. And the songwriter, we're going to only pay 100% mechanical on, we don't want it on stream. So we're going to choose physical and then just repeat and choose 100% mechanical and digital. So physical sales, digital sales, we're going to pay mechanical, but we don't want to pay them on streams. So that's one way to do it as a totally different structure. Um, and this can be automated uh, information that can be imported so that you don't have to you know, go through this manual selection. But it's great to go through this one time so that you can see how the program works and how you're going to use it because not everybody is going to be paying the same way. I just threw in 99 cent sales price for the track, but it's not critical. We can, if we hit apply, it saves. If we hit OK, it does apply and saves. Goes to this next screen. So we finished the setup. We have a product. We have uh, two royalty holders, each getting separate deals. And we want to test it out. So we can create an order. And yes, uh, Dashbook has the ability, let's uh, make this full screen. Dashbook has the ability to uh, import orders. But for now, we're just going to create one. And let's pretend that we got this from IOTA. And it was a song. Now, here is the sales channel for the order. Now, yes, uh, IOTA will give you both physical and streams on the same 
sales support, our import can extract out just the physical to be able to pull up a physical order, and you run it a second time and to extract just the uh, streams to do a streaming order. That way you can differentiate by the sales channel here, physical digital stream that we can set up. We're just going to leave everything else alone. If we uh, save that, we're fine, but it won't actually make royalty calculations until we close the order and save it. That says we're finished with it. You notice it through an extra box there for calculation. So here with the sale, um, everything's done, and I'll show you the results in a second. But let's go ahead and make another one, another order, same iota. We could just double click that, right? And song one again. But let's make this to a stream instead. Close, apply changes. We're done. If we want to see the results, Dashbook has a wonderful troubleshooting ability. Let's choose the order, go to advanced, where you can do complex uh, multiple orders and multiple uh, invoices and shipments, and choose royalties. This is a kind of a, a you know audit trail of what's happening that's specific to this order, so it, it really helps to find out what's going on. And you can see on this physical sale, we paid the songwriter 100% of the mechanical is 9.1 cents because we didn't affect the we didn't change the um, song length so it just presumes five minutes and uh, the artist got 50 percent of what was received okay and that's there and then if we switch over to the second one which is only a stream you notice we didn't pay the songwriter this time we've only paid the artist 50 percent of that now the actual stream rate of course wouldn't have been 99 cents but uh, uh, you know that. It's just a matter of um, you know what was done here, and the import will pull in all the information for you. So that's it. You can see that uh, you know Dashbook can handle the complexities of having a different structure pay out depending on how something was sold, or um, you know depending on who you sold it, sold to. So maybe uh, you know a government agency or a uh, mass-produced distributor, uh, mass-distributed uh, system, you might pay something different. Thank you.